Hey what is up guys my name is Ikalab and today I'm going to be showing you how to offset your text in Photoshop so basically this is just a simple trick that I found on the Photoshop so you can use it on your uh, channel banner thumbnails or other artwork it, uh, it's even way more simple than using, doing so in Illustrator like the other tutorials so let's, without further ado let's get started First, what you're going to do is to uh, create a new document, and the resolution is just uh, whatever you like. I just go with uh, thumbnail size. So here it is, your canvas. Uh, next, so I'm going to type something like offset, maybe. Montserrat. This is a font that I uh, totally recommend. It's a Spencer font. And it's free. It's called Montserrat. A little bit of color, like maybe like blue, something like this. Put it in the middle. What you do it? Okay. And next, what you're going to do next is uh, create a, another text, which is smaller. I'll, ju I'll just go with Master of Break. Uh, like, I type something like text. Uh, change the color so it looks different. Uh, pretty much like uh, dark blue, I think. It's cool. Let's get it down. And put something somewhere here. So, as you can see right here, it's. Uh, it has uh, some kind of space between this text and the text in the bottom. So to do so, what you're going to do is uh, let's rise this offset. Uh, so, so you can just duplicate the layer. If you saw, if you messed up, you, ha you have a, ba a backup. Just simply uh, vanish this up and rasterize the type. And next what you're going to do is just uh, use your magic wand on your text in the front to select all of them next click select modify and expand something like five pixels or maybe four pixels I guess click OK as you can see if the selection is kind of expanded from the text in the front and what you're going to do next well, while your this layer is selected, click delete and deselect. And as you can see right here, it's more more of a and yeah, there's a space between this text and this text. But unfortunately, on this on Photoshop, it's not reversible. So which is why I use this uh, backup because as you can see right here it's once it's move it's can it cannot be yeah it's not reversible so yeah that's basically how you do an offset on your text uh, you can you can do it on on a what is it a photo photo like so so make it even more beautiful uh, just a basic typography or so so uh, so yeah that's how you offset your text on your uh, on Photoshop and if you really like this tutorial and you find this tutorial helpful uh, please leave a like let's aim for maybe um five likes and leave a comment for some feedback so what you're going to what I'm what I'm going to record and upload in the next upload and maybe even subscribe for more tutorial videos and design tutorials and my name is Akati and I'm Sonny